Hi submarine friends. The next thing that I have to install in the submarine is the CO2 scrubber. And that's this guy right here. And the purpose of this thing is to remove the excess CO2 from when you exhale. So the submarine has a life support system which includes the CO2 scrubber removing the CO2 that you exhale and then it has an oxygen injection system which is really just a, an oxygen line bleeding oxygen into the environment at a set rate. It's actually not a specific rate because everybody uses oxygen at a different rate. So anyways, this is the CO2 scrubber from uh, my deep worker submarine over there. It's a spare. So the way it works is it just opens on the top here. This lid comes off. You fill it with uh, absorbent, the same stuff that scuba divers use with their rebreathers. So just latches back together and that's all there is to it. This side here is being difficult, but anyways, there we go. Now the cool thing about this scrubber is I cannot believe my luck. Every now and then when you build a project, whether you're drywalling or fabricating something, you go to the, your junk pile or wherever to get a piece of material and you find a piece that fits absolutely perfect without cutting it or making it. Well, that happened here. So I put this electric panel in, which is an aluminum shelf out of a fire truck. So the back compartment of the fire truck has shelves for tools. That's what this is. And all I did is cut it to length, cut this slot, boom, there it is. So this is how lucky I am. Watch how this fits. So this sits right there. Fits like a glove. No modifications, nothing. All I have to do is build a little bracket to hold it in place. I mean, talk about lucky. This must be a sign. This is a good sign. So anyways, that's what I'm doing now. I'm mounting the scrubber. How easy is that? Ciao.